I, I thought I would start this out. I'm going to give the adults a heads up, and then we'll continue our conversation, okay? Those of you who've been here in the weeks before maybe remember, and for those of you who haven't, we're going to have a time where we're going to have a question for you all. So I wanted to let you know, in your pews with the attendance clipboards, you should hopefully find a thing of post-it notes and also a box of crayons because we're going to ask a question here in a minute and we're going to invite everyone to answer it and if you're comfortable doing so to take and write your answer on your note and we'll collect that here in a little bit. Oh, they've got them. We've checked them. So, But I wanted to give you all a heads up that it was there and then we will talk about our message this morning. So before we begin though, will you guys mind if I ask Aries to do me a quick favor? Okay. Is it all right, Aries? Can you go over to our sign and le read our last question to us this morning? And can I give you, give you the microphone? Will you read that for us? What are, we, what are you praising God for? What are you praising God for? What are you praying God for? Praising. Praising is praise. Praising. So, today, if you guys remember, we did a lot of work coloring this this morning. Yeah, I can't read that word. So, which word is that? So, let's try that really quickly. Okay, I think everybody can see it. We don't have to hold it quite that high, guys. In fact, why don't you let me hold it so you can see it? Okie dokie. So, now. What did we say here? We have my soul, and then the big word, magnifies the Lord. Now, can you guys rejoice the Lord? All right. So, what does that mean, guys? What does my soul magnifies the Lord mean? It basically means that we're praying to God. Could be praying to God. Does it sound like a way we would praise God? People have to pray to God for something. Well, how do we praise God? What could we do to praise God? Do you have any ideas? We could hold our, we could hold our hands in front of our faces and say what we're trying to pray for to God. Okay, that would be one way. Do we have any other ideas on how we praise Being God? Being thankful about something. Say again? Being thankful about something. Being thankful, that could be a way that we praise Even God. Even if you don't like it. <laughs> oh, I think if you're being thankful, you probably do like it. So, do you have an idea on how to praise God? Well, I've got maybe an idea. Do you have an idea, Annie? How would you praise God? You know one of the things that we've done? You know one of the things we've done in the past, guys? We've done some singing. Bless you. Sing. Singing. Our prayer is singing so we can shoot up to God. So that's a way we praise God then is in our By singing. By singing, it has a pray in, to God. So okay. basically send it up to God. So if we've got all of these ways that we can praise God, what are we praising God for? That's being, our question today. Being, thank, being thankful and um, having fun and doing things with your family like games, eating, and presents. So praising God for our family and our presents. Presents are tomorrow. What are, do you have something Christmas you want to praise God for, Ariana? Everyone loves Christmas. Do you have something you want to praise God for? For having good families. Say again. For having good families. For having that good we families love. that we love. I like that. Is there something either of you guys would like to praise God for? Mm, my grandma. Okay. For the world. Go ahead. For the world and all the resources it has. Okay, so God's blessed us with the world that we live in. For all the people and our family in it. Okay. I bet if we really got to thinking about this, we have a whole bunch of things that we could praise God for, oh, yeah. don't we? Don't we? I bet the adults probably have a bunch of things that they could be praising God for, too. Yep. So let me ask you something. We've spent all this time during December getting to today, and we're talking about praising God today. Is this the only day that we're going to praise God? No. Nope. Nope. Okay. We're going to do it till the end of time of church. Every day. Every day till the end of time, huh? Yep. Or just the end of church. People need to go to church. Can you praise God at home? Yep. Yeah. Can you guys? How would you do that? Yeah. I would put my legs over my head. No. That's an interesting way to praise God. 
It's okay. Does anybody else have any ideas on how you praise God at home? Like when you're about, when you're about to eat dinner, you praise Him for the food okay. and the choice in it and the tastiness. So maybe with our prayers at dinner time, that's a good way. So, well, no, we don't need to do that praise today. That's okay. I do that at home. I'm in pants. <laughs> so, so we know how we praise God, and we've had some ideas on why we praise God. Do you think the parents have some good ideas? Do you think our adults have some ideas as well? Mm. Have you all had a chance to think about how you are, what you are praising God for? Is anybody, oh, I see somebody who's saying they're done. Has anybody else had a chance to fill theirs? Shall we go get those guys? Good job. It's not about who gets the most, it's that we get them all to the front. I do not care, I'm still going to get them. <laughs> How are we doing, guys? Oh, we got some there. All right, so let's see if we can get those up there and on the board, huh? There you go. Let's see, I see a couple more hands back there. Oh, there we go. I still see a couple. Okay, someone got me a little bit of their sticky notes without biting. That's quite all right. We can just put those aside and we'll I use them I later. Keep them. Okay. Now, do we have any more? Not today. Nostalgia Fest. You said that last time. I know. Nostalgia Fest. Oh, I see a couple over there. Are you just going to put them on your arm, Mariana? I see a couple over there. That's a weird way to do that. Yeah. All right. Let's see if we can put these up, can we? Why don't you bring those up, Ariana, and we'll put them on our board. We don't have time right now, okay? Later. We'll talk about it later. <laughs> All right. Last call for adults. Does everybody get theirs picked up? If not, raise your hand if you don't. Hand up high for a minute. If don't have yours. What do you think, guys? Look it's like we got everybody? Speaker. Yeah. I think we got everybody. I think we did because the phone's raising their hand. Now, I know we probably didn't have time to really read any of them, but our adults probably had some pretty good answers on what they're praising God for. Do we have some good answers? I yeah. thought we did, too. And we've covered the whole board with it. Yeah, and that's what we're praising. I have some weird oh. ways of praising to God. Do you have one on the praise? Go ahead and see if she's got one for you. Oh, perfect. I'm glad we got Margaret's too. All right. So, we're not going to be done with our praising Ooh, God today, add right, guys? To the board. No. We, well, then, if we think we've learned what we're praising God for and the adults know what they're praising God for, then let's go ahead and continue our worship, all right? So can we say a minute of prayer before we leave? Can we pray together, guys? All right. Ariana, do you want to come pray with us? I want this place because that thing just poked in my eyebrow. All right. Let's pray. Dear God, Thank you on this Christmas Eve day for sending Jesus to be with us in the world. 
to show us your love and to teach us how we can live. For this we give you our praise because you have given us such a wonderful and amazing gift. Thank you for loving us and thank you for helping us to learn how we can love each other better. We pray that this will be the thing that we learn not just here at Christmas but all the year round as we say thank you and offer our prayers back to you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Everyone loves God.